Hello, today I'm going to attempt to cook these two bratwursts here in this uh, Ninja Foodie. I'm going to start out by poking a few holes in them. I'm going to turn them over and do the same thing on the other side. That helps leave the relieve the pressure in there and they they uh, don't just burst wide open and everything. So now let me move over to the foodie here. Okay, now we'll lay them right down here in this uh, crisper basket. Just like that. And now we'll shut the lid. Go ahead, turn on the power. And we're going to do air crisp and we're going to go 375 and I want to go for uh, 16 minutes okay and then I'm going to hit the power button now the reason I said 16 minutes because I want, I want a total cook time of 16 minutes but after 8 minutes I'm going to stop it and turn them over and see how they're doing it all so we'll see when we get to there and so if I got a while ago a second if y'all can join my channel and give me a thumbs up I sure would appreciate it thank you for watching my video we'll be back in a minute or two <laughs> okay now it's coming up on oh, about eight minutes now matter of fact that's Seven minutes and 59 seconds left. Oh, did you see how those things are really plumped up there? So, we'll take and roll them over. Oh, yeah, those look nice, don't they? Look like they've been on some kind of grill. Yeah, look at that. Now, that's some good looking brats right there, just where they are. <laughs> I was still want to finish cooking them though. I don't think it's going to take the full eight minutes on this side, so let's see. So, we'll get started again here. Uh, like I say, I really don't think it's going to take it long on this side, but we'll check in a minute just to make sure. It's been in there a little bit over two minutes since I flipped them. I will. Well, it up here and take a look at them because I don't want them all shriveled up and overdone and stuff. So let's take a look. I see that really looks good to me. I'm going to take one out and set it over here and slice into it just to see. So let me get the camera turned around so you can see it. So you see the juices just coming out back there? That really looks good. Okay, there it is on this plate now. Let's see we got here oh yes fork just fell through there yeah that's done done that is just right so now what I'm going to do is Take me this bun here and set it there. I'm going to take some of this uh, All American little squeeze cheese. I don't know what you call that stuff, but anyway, I'm going to put a little bit in here. Like that. Then we'll take this other brock and put it right in there. If I pick it up. There it is. Just like that. Now I'm just actually going to set this down in this uh, 
foodio here for just a minute to let it cook and get that uh, cheese good and melted. I'm not going to get it so hot to where I can't pick it up, I don't think. So, we'll see in a second. Cheese good and hot, it's toasting that bun a little bit. And then we'll come over here and we'll put some of this uh, Heinz yellow mustard on it. And this uh, Heinz sweet relish on it. And then we'll get ready to chow down. For almost two minutes, and I'm not gonna let it stay in there any longer than that. I decided to pick it up with these tongs here instead of uh, trying to put my hands down there again. So now, it's got all that good old cheese down there in it. Do me a little mustard right here. Now for some good old sweet pickle relish. Well, gotta get it out. Now it'll come out. Yeah. Now look at that, boys and girls. Don't that look great? I'm going to be fat as a pig if I don't quit eating all this stuff. Mm. That was so good. So, so sweet. It's just like somebody poured sugar on it or something. So anyway, that's it for my little video on this uh Rotwurst here. Rotwurst and sweet relish and yellow mustard and easy cheese American from Nabisco and and the Ninja Foodie of course that makes it all possible. I'm gonna tell you what, if y'all ever have rotwurst like this, you probably won't ever want to go back on the grill again. So you just sort of give it a try one time, you just don't go believe how the flavor stays with them. So until next time, y'all have a real good day now and come back and see me real soon. Hope to have another video for you soon. Goodbye now.